The Wood Tick Theater has been a staple in downtown Akeley for decades, playing a little bit of everything all summer long. For this week's In Focus, Mal Meyer dropped in on a recent performance and talked to some of the band members about how the music has changed over time. Band members are finishing up their fine tuning as locals and tourists begin to take their seats. It's the same place that people have been coming to for the last 25 years. A few years after the original owners opened the doors, they were ready to move on and offered the place up to the band. I was the first one to step forward and say, okay, I'll take it. The variety show is just that, a little bit of knowledge. It looks like we got a really good week around here. Some eye roll worthy jokes, you but a whole lot of soul. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Wood Tick 2017. Once focused on country music, over time it's transformed into bluegrass, pop, jazz, and more. I mentioned that we're stretching the envelope a little further each year with the Woodsick Show. For the band's longest lasting member, Diane Sawyer says her favorite part this year is singing Seven Bridges Road. I like leading songs too, but singing with somebody and then matching their tone is just so satisfying. Not only does the set change year after year, but for the band, the biggest change is the audience. You get a new crowd every night and you just get to interact in different ways, you know, you know, try new jokes, try new things. It's one of the reasons Paul Nye has stuck around for the last 14 years. Seeing them laugh and enjoy themselves, that, that supersedes pretty much everything. You know, it's just, uh, it's just, it, it's a cool thing. Here's a song from 1974 called, When Will I Be Loved? While the band stays up on stage, they frequently pause and take time to interact with their guests. We try to be real personal with them, and I think that sets us aside. No spoilers here, but if you're still not convinced, the band has a special surprise waiting for you at the very end. This year, people have said that's worth the ticket price alone, and that's that's the top secret. <laughs> you got to come here to to see that. In Akeley, with this week's in focus, I'm Mal Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.